I'm back one more time and sadly I'm missing 16 minutes of footage now. For some reason my OBS just recorded a black screen, I don't know why. And basically what just happened, I killed one wolf and realized that I get a level up when I kill just one. And I took uh, Melvs because Skull Trap is really nice, but I don't think I can one shot enemy groups with it right now. So I still want to focus on just killing a single enemy quickly and then just go back and rest. And the cool thing is that with just one or with just two casts of mad of uh, Melfs and a couple of magic missiles and darts, uh, I mean sling things, you can actually one shot most enemies or well, not one shot but kill them a lot quicker. That's what I mean. So yes, sadly I did not record my level up and I did not record how I killed the wolves. I also might have missed one or two goblins I killed here. Uh, ox I mean. Let's see. Is this one the only one? Yeah. Okay, I also killed two ox. So I want to lure this guy out here before I blind him. There we go. So he's confined to this space here. Oh, he just saved. I had one interesting thing, by the way, happen. An enemy saved against my blind and still was blinded. I guess that didn't happen with this guy, though. I have to turn that off. Okay, that was very strange. And that was very lucky. I keep saving. It doesn't really matter because kiting kind of works better without blind. But the thing about blind is that it also, re also reduces the armor class so I don't have any misses when the enemy is blinded. But normally these orcs don't resist blind as often as this guy just is showing right now. So I kind of could have used my spells for something else than blind and killed them a lot more quickly. Wait, is he blind now? This is so strange. Yeah, he's blind all of a sudden, even though he's saved. This happened to me before with a wolf. Yep, he's blinded. Let's go back up here. Yep, safe against spell. And no other blind cast after that. That is really strange. But he's also almost dead. go um yeah next spell is probably gonna be skull trap yes so I can start taking out bigger enemy groups um, what I want to try now is just pull a single orc out here If there's two, okay, that didn't work. Maybe I can still pu pull one. Yeah, I think they didn't notice me. So 
Sometimes that works. Yeah, looks like it's only one. Oh no, it's two. Okay. That's less good, but we're gonna manage. Blind is your friend. Maybe even Sham. Just gonna abuse this area transition once again. And I need like four more orcs for next level. This area transition is quite fun with a thief because of trap stacking. Um, let's try a charm first. Nope. Oh, there's three of them. Okay, that's dangerous. If I had known that, I would have tried blind right away. Mm. I just reload the autosave. Doesn't really do much for me reloading that, but at least I get one spell back. That's something. This is so weird. When it doesn't tell you that it's saved. And it definitely did. Oh, there's a ranger there. Okay. Um. Hmm. I could just leave and rest, but I didn't know there was a ranger there. Sorry for doing this again. Need to do something against the ranger. It's important. Maybe I should use invisibility to get close. Which one is the ranger? It's so hard to see sometimes. Is it this one? Yes, okay. Now I'm probably gonna die. Okay. I guess I have a lot more HP than I thought. It's saved. Okay, I'm not gonna abuse reloading again. that I'm just gonna abuse this area here. Oh, I'm frozen after that. That's bad. So I have to try to either blind or charm the ranger. Charm would be a lot better, but I think it's not gonna happen. Saved again. Let's wait for Aura to be clear again. Oh, he's gone now. Oh, and I'm in a bad spot. Is he actually blind now? No. Right? Oh, no, he isn't. Okay.
Come on. Did I cancel my spell by walking away or something? Usually I listen to the sound that it's cast. But I guess I cancelled it. This is annoying. Yeah, that doesn't work. Okay, this is not what I wanted at all. I wanted to split them up. Like I did with the previous orcs. I guess I should have attempted blind while they were still in the cave. Because that's what I did with the previous orcs as well. I thought I might be able to just pull one of them. That's why I didn't do it. Mm. I don't think this is going to work out at all. Oh, okay, finally. That's very helpful. I think I'm just gonna focus the ranged one and kill him. If I can. But I should be able to. This is kind of annoying, but totally doable. So to recast my Melves, I'm going to have to abuse the map again. Because these guys keep walking into my face. Hmm, maybe I can just cast it. Okay. That was very nice. And goodbye. Now I'm just gonna go and rest, I think. Maybe I can kill one more of them. I still should have quite a few magic missiles. No, I don't. I have one. Okay. Mm. Let's just rest. I should also keep my magic missiles when I rest. Uh, my melves when I rest. But I don't know if it's the same in this game. Some things are changed, like for example, Skull Trap disappears if you rest or make an area transition. It's another reason I didn't pick it as first spell. Also, the next time I'm gonna 
fight a ranged guy, I probably should cast my armor spell before I fight him. That is gonna get me to minus two, so that could be pretty helpful not getting interrupted. Okay, I kept my mouths. That's nice. very good of me. I just have to keep trying to blind them. Sham isn't really working out for me the way I hoped it would. blind I can blind one more than I can fight I just cast a mouth off the map try and blind the one that isn't injured yet. This is so interesting. How does he save against spell and is blinded? I have that so often. Or is this actually an area effect? in this game. No, it's one creature. This is so strange. Maybe I should read the description. Blinds its target. Well... Either way. I can kite this guy now. So, ow. That's all I wanted. Maybe I should try not to die in the process. bad nice two more I think I'm still gonna go and rest because of my HP. At some point the Dragon Disciple is gonna get enough constitution to regain HP on resting even though it's an elf. That's pretty good actually. One of the reasons I picked Dragon Disciple but not the main reason of course. The main reason is just that this mode H or F is not as crazy as LOB and AC actually matters in this mode. It shall be done. 
I could also heal some HP at the temple. But I'm gonna try and avoid it. Saved. And still got blinded. Again, the same thing. I'm not complaining or anything. But it is kind of dumb. Okay, sorry, just got a steam message. I hope that beeping noise didn't come through here. There's not enough room for kiting here, so I'm gonna go over here instead. Oh, stupid AI. As soon as there's two enemies on the screen, the AI just is gonna automatically attack the wrong one. I don't know why. <laughs> Every single time. Let's give him a parting present. Because we can. Nice. Yeah, it's no use. I'm gonna rest again. This speeds up things so much, and I need HP back anyway. Only getting 2 HP per rest at the moment. Now of course as soon as I have 20 con then I'm just gonna get all back. Even on traveling between maps. So yeah, I think the Dragon Disciple is not that bad in this game. It sucks not to have all your spell slots. It definitely does. Oh, that was kind of bad. I didn't expect him to come after me. I might get one shot here. Or not attacked at all because of blindness. That was helpful. He's blinded, right? What? I'm pretty sure that blind worked. Yep. So now now we had everything. We had blind, 
that was supposed not to work and still it did. And now we have a blind that's supposed to work and it didn't. I hope at least the AC is adjusted. Well, I'm pretty sure it isn't. should be level up now there we go another level 3 spell that's nice oh and another level 1 spell as well um, I wonder if I should go this for healing The damage of magic missiles is pretty nice. But being able to heal at least sometimes is nice too. Then again I will get more corn and I will get a regen spell at some point as well. I don't know if this is my last level 1 spell because if it is I probably should take identify. I think this might be my last level one spell. Let's take identify. It's not that important to have because you can identify at temples. But I feel like for a sorcerer it's pretty cool to have. Right. Here I could go knock for opening chests. And what else? So many good level 2 spells. I could pretty much take anything here. They're all good. Um, blur is going to be important later. The same as with protection from evil. I took it now, but I'm not really using it now. But later on it's going to be really good when I fight in melee. <coughs> Of course mirror image. Yeah, I should just take mirror image. I'm not gonna use it very often at the moment because I'm kiting. But it's one of those super essential spells to have. And here I'm pretty sure I'm gonna take Skull Trap. Check all the spells, but Yeah, I think Skull Trap is as I said, it's a bit different here. If you rest or leave the area, it will disappear. So you can just use it as a plain damage spell and not trap stuck with it. But of course, since it isn't capped in levels, if I'm level 30, this does an insane amount of damage. And even now, it's not bad, the damage. Not bad at all. I might actually be able to one-shot Ox with it. I don't know. I might. Five attacks from the Mavs, of course. So yeah, I have one, two, three, four level one spells. That means I am gonna get another one. No, I'm not. I didn't get the identify because I didn't rest. Okay, so that was the last spell. Alright. Fair enough. Right, I'm gonna end the recording here. And this time, I hope everything got recorded right. And sorry again about the missing part. It wasn't really that interesting. Kiting three wolves while they're blinded. And 
well, for the first one I didn't have Melves. And for the other two I had Melves, so I killed them the same way I killed these orcs. See you next time.